Do you wanna instantly filter through your leads to find exactly what you're looking for? Well, today, that's what we're gonna do. Please, as always, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on all REI tips and deal machine tutorials. Say you wanna go on the map and you're driving for dollars, but you wanna find out where these certain properties are that maybe are vacant houses that were sold over 10 years ago. You can go ahead and filter through those and then see the highlights on the map so you know which areas you should be targeting or where your driver should should be targeting. Say you're in the leads tab and you're wanting to start sending out mail, but only to properties in a certain zip code that have not started with a marketing campaign yet. Filters is there to help you do that in under three minutes. So let's dive right into it. So say I'm out driving right now, I'm on my map, I go over to my highlights. So I wanna look at expired listings. So then I apply this filter and then I can zoom out from where I'm at and I can see where these expired listings are in my area. So I see there's a handful just in this area alone. So I can say, I wanna go drive over there and it's not that far from me. So I can already go that way and I can find properties on my way over there. But I know that these highlighted properties are expired listings. Let's say you wanna look for vacant houses that are owned by out of state owners. I go to my highlights then what I'm going to do is go to create a highlight. I can search then by vacant. And owner type, out of state absentee. And then I'm going to say that this is vacant absentee out of state and save that. So I saved it and then apply the highlight to my map. And again, it's gonna show me where those properties are. I can go drive by them, maybe talk to someone who's there, a neighbor that can get me more information about the owner if they know anything. So try this out on driving, but we're gonna actually go to leads next. We do have a video already to show you how to bulk edit in your leads list that you can check in the card above or at the end of this video. Now going into my leads list, I wanna actually look for ones, like I said before, that are going to be pending approval, which means I have not started mail marketing to them, but are ones that are in a certain zip code that I'm looking to market in. So we go to leads. So I'm going to go to filters, create filter. I'm going to go to lead status is pending approval. And go to property address. Zip code is equal to and confirm. Apply. And it's gonna show me right here, I have 537. Then what I can do is just select these, select all, and start my mail marketing. I challenge you today to use not only the filters feature in the leads tab, but also go out and use those highlights and see what you think. Tell me what combinations that you have put together for your driving for dollars or for your mail marketing campaigns. Like I said, don't forget to check out this video right here. It is all about bulk editing and you're going to wanna to partner that with this video with filtering through leads to save you so much time when you're doing bulk actions. And as always, Happy deal finding.